Hi, my name is Quinlet. Please, for those of you who are watching me for the first time, you are highly welcome. I am a gospel minister. I have added my voice to this issue trending on social media about the death of our beloved sister minister, Osinachi Wanchuku. I said in my previous video that we were supposed to have a collaboration together, but uh, for some reasons we reshared it. Uh, we collaborated minister Jimmy the Psalmist in this song. The song is called Wind Blow. If you check YouTube, you type Quinlet Music. The song is there. You can watch it and it will bless your life. In my previous video, I was asking what to make a married woman stay in an abusive marriage. And slowly, I believe some answers are coming out. A uh, lot of people are saying so many things, concrete evidences uh, from credible websites. And definitely, we will get there. Please listen to this voice before I proceed. So, the, f the very first voice that started is the voice of my management team. They were talking to the late minister Osinachi Wanchuku concerning the song because her, her, her husband wanted us to talk to her as well. And she said, yeah, give, uh, let my husband listen to the song. We wanted to tell her that we've spoken with the husband already, mm -hmm. but she was insisting that we should let her oga, if you heard it very well, let my oga listen to the song and he will get back to me. I'm still asking, what to make a married woman stay in an abusive marriage? According to Vanguard website, do you know that Mr. Peter Uwanchuku was having a secret wife? It shocked me and I know it will shock you too. How did that come out? They interviewed his son. His son said he was at home and he saw that his, fa his father's door was opened. Please note his father's door. I'll talk about it. So out of curiosity, this young man entered the room and he said the moment he entered the room, a voice spoke to him that make a check. Search everywhere. And he said, he saw an album and he was going through. Here was a picture of his father and another woman. Wedding pictures. He said when he saw it, he put it right at the same place and he left. He never told anybody, not even his mother because he was afraid. I caught him, he said, I was afraid that if I tell my mother and my father get to know about it, he will kill me. The young man said, whilst he watched through the pictures, he saw that his father lived a wayward life, according to his own son. I'm not the one saying it. The young man also said, he suspected that his, his mother was aware of a secret relationship in which his father was. But it was like the, the woman is not having any concrete evidence, so she could not too, talk too much about that particular issue. Why is the woman not talking about such things whilst she is suspecting something? Now, I told you to note something. His father's door was opened. Men, I need questions. I, sorry, I need answers from you, please. What happens when you get money? You start to get your own rooms. You start to give the women, the women their own rooms. Whilst you were poor together, from beginning, that humble beginning, you were living in people's apartments, single room. That was not even yours. You were renting. You develop, you divided that room with a curtain. Behind the curtain was your, your bed. In, uh, 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 on the other side or in the corner was your chair, your tables, where you eat. The other side is where you store water. Then slowly you move into a chamber hall. That place where you live there together peacefully with your wife. And you begin to get money. Then you begin to have your own rooms. 
Yes, you say, yeah, I want to be able to study. I want to be able to pray. You were praying when you were in that small room. And God heard you. You were studying whilst you were in that small room. So what changed? A lot of pastors do that. They have their own rooms. Their wives have their own, own rooms. Normally, the women are not even allowed to go to the men's room unless they are invited. Or perhaps they have to come together uh, as married people and have an affair. What changed? A man's room and a woman's room. It brings secret affairs. Because you don't know what the man is doing in his room. You don't know what the woman is doing in her room. I believe I'm talking to intelligent people. I know that those who are listening to me, they are broad-minded people. They are critical thinkers. And they are very knowledgeable. Now, if it is true that the late Osinachi Uwanchuku knew or she suspected that her husband was having a secret affair, could it be the reason for staying in that abusive marriage? Because I know a lot of women. I have lived in a compound house. I know what I'm talking about. The moment they realize that a woman is in the life of their, their men, they will never and ever leave that marriage. They will never and ever leave that relationship. Even if the men are cutting off their throat, they will never leave. And you dare not pull them out of that relationship. No matter how abusive it is, no matter how bad they have been treated, if their mother say they will not listen, if their father say they will not listen, you dare not talk about it because they don't want to be called losers. They, want, they don't want people to mock them. They don't want to leave that relationship, that marriage for that, that woman. Especially if the man is married, two, three. The man is having other women. Oh my God. They will never leave this marriage. So could it be the reason for the, the, the late minister staying in that marriage in the year 2020, uh, 2017 according to the late Osinachi Chukus elder sister that was the only time she visited their hometown after she got married and that was the time their father died. And whilst they were coming, she was together with her husband, Mr. Peter Wanchuku. He was driving and he was speeding up. And his wife said, Oga, like he, she said right uh, in the conversation, because she calls her my Oga. Please slow down. All that she, she had was pa on her face. She was slapped on her face. How did this come out? According to Vanguard website their little sister was there so she saw it 2017 we are in which year now so it means this woman is going through all this and she never told anybody and when she's not allowed to visit her family member sometimes i understand certain things because a lot of family collapse marriages if you allow them to be coming up and down, going up and down, by the time you realize your marriage is sinking and a lot of people do this separation, they build these walls around them to save their marriages. So that one, I can't talk so much about it. But in this case, that was not the issue because her twin sister said by her bedside at the hospital, she was there. Mr. Peter Wonchuku drove her away. And the, the, the woman... The sick lady had no option. She said, I have pains in my chest. The man said, no, she must go. So she had no option. She said, please go. If my husband says you should go, go. This is so sad. Unfortunately, we couldn't do this collaboration. Maybe I could have come closer to this woman. Maybe there, there is something I could have done. Maybe listen to her story. Oh God. She died of clotted blood in her heart. According to Vanguard website i'll come another time please check me out on all social media platforms at quillet music
Twitter Queen Lit Music, Instagram Queen Lit Music, Facebook Queen Lit Music.